All right, hello everyone, it's Team Rocket Dross here with another Pokemon card opening. And for this video, guys, we're gonna be opening the Champion's Path Collection the Wolf V Box. So I'm pretty excited, guys. I haven't opened too many Champion's Path uh, packs, so I'm actually excited for this one. So I'll post up a price on screen on how much they're running for right now as of this video. And then I'll also be putting up the prices of some of the cards if they're worth more than $3. And all the prices, guys, are of this video. So October, I'm recording this October and November um, to 2020. So just so you guys get an idea, just in case you guys watch this later on. All right, guys, so we could get started. So let me just show you guys right here. So we do have the four packs. We also get the double V. And I believe this is going to be a promo card, although I can't see right now so far. And uh, yeah, let's actually check out the bag just in case you guys want to get a look at it. Double up with double V. So if you guys want to check it out, guys, just pause the video. But it does come with one foil promo card featuring double V. One foil oversized, which is the big one that we, the jumbo card. Four TCG Champions Pack Booster uh, packs and then a code card. So let me just get this open really quick and uh, yeah, let's get started. All right, guys. So there we go. So we do have our jumbo card which is the same as the promo card that we have down here uh but just so you guys get a better look at it i'm just going to show you guys uh the jumbo card um so it has stability soft wool this pokemon takes 30 less damage from attacks after applying weaknesses and resistance so it does a revenge blast which does 120 plus this attack does 30 more damage for each price card on your opponent has taken so this is actually a, a decent card as far as i know guys this is probably playable like i said i'm not too familiar with the tcg um so we do have the actual card down here and uh it seems like it's it's decent centering wise it's decent it's probably better than uh, the ones that we actually pull so let me just show you guys uh, in case you guys are interested it's not the best centering but it is what it is and um yeah i'm not this is not one of those cards that i'll be grading so let me sleeve it up and the reason that i wouldn't grade something like this is because there's so many of them out there guys there's way more other cards that i have that are rather um actually send out right instead of uh, something like this one and then we also have the quarter card right here just in case you guys I uh, want to get that and yes guys you guys are free to open or to get any of those code cards um, in my videos because I know some of you guys have been asking so we do end up getting our four packs we ended up getting uh, oh okay so we're missing I believe just one art pack and uh, yeah so I guess we could get started with I'm gonna leave this one for last so let's just go like this and start off this way Sorry guys, I'm moving some of the stuff away. And uh, yeah, let's get started. First of all, I ended up getting this box, guys, from a subscription that I have. I ended up ordering it, pre-ordering it almost. Um, and uh, I was able to get it a little bit cheaper than what you guys might find these for um, on store or online. And uh, which is actually pretty cool. Here's the code card. Um, I believe all of them are going to be white, right? If not, then I just messed that up. And I believe it's four. And uh, yeah, we're going to start off with an electric energy. We have a Kaboo Trainer, Absol. We got a Beedrill, which is an uncommon. It's actually a really cool Beedrill. Uh, there's not too many of these that I haven't, um, that I've seen more like it. We got Scraggy. Seems like they did something. They're running away. Uh, we got Hatina as our reverse, which is a common. And for our first rare, guys, of the video, it's going to be a regular. Oh, there we go. We ended up getting a hollow Psyguard, which I don't have. So uh, not bad. I'll take this for sure. That's actually pretty cool. Let me just leave it up really quick. And I know that some of these actually uh, are really they tend to you tend to get them a lot guys they're quite repetitive um since it's a small set right it's uh, 73 cards so this is 28 out of 73 nonetheless this is actually really cool so let me just set this aside and um i'm probably gonna be making a mess over here guys so i apologize so now for the next one and uh Oh, there we go. So I ended up buying two of these boxes, one to open, guys, and one to keep. Uh, just because that's another thing that I've been collecting lately is the actual uh, stuff. Like, not just the actual packs, not just um, opening everything. 
one two three four and obviously we're going for that uh, charizard right so we're gonna start off with steel energy we have team yo grunt we got a machoke a rotom bike trainer roly coley which is actually a really cool pokemon um colossal is one of my favorite pokemon uh six agoon weedle i really like those like heavy set like like tough you know like a uh, ground type rock type pokemon for some reason i really like those pokemon that's one of the reasons that i uh, kind of named my channel after team rocket right because i always like those type of pokemons and giovanni's gym he has like right on right horn right nero king nero queen mewtwo is my favorite uh, legendary and uh, everything just matches right what what i like so that's why i kind of named my channel after team rocket uh, so reverse is gonna be a pokeball trainer so let me know in the comment section guys which is your favorite uh type like um let, let's go with the gym type since uh champions pad has a lot to do with gyms um what kind of gym is your favorite type and let me know why so we ended up getting a common pokeball reverse and for a rare we ended up getting a hello machamp which i don't have so once again i'll, I'll take it and uh, i know this is one of those repetitive uh cards that people tend to get but like i mentioned before i don't have it so i'll take it since i don't really open too many um then i don't mind getting it one bit so let's go with the next one and uh i'm pretty excited guys let me know also in the comment section how many of these you've opened and another thing that i wanted to mention that i almost forgot was that i also ended up getting or pre-ordering an elite trainer box I actually got two once again uh one to open and then one to keep uh so i'll be expecting that to get here i pre-ordered it so it should be here in within a month i imagine like i don't know that i still haven't gotten the message uh, but i was actually able to pre-order it from pokemon center uh before it ended up getting filled uh, which didn't take long um, so I'm glad that I was able to get those two just in time. So Scraggy, Pokeball, Nicket, uh, Hatina. Uh, Purloin is going to be a reverse, which is another common. And I kind of like that art. So I'm just going to choose this one for our favorite art of the video. And uh, our rare is going to be... We didn't get an ultra rare, guys, but we did get a hollow, a uh, Senti Scorch hollow, which once again, I don't have, so I'll take it, guys. And I don't think all of these are hollows, right? Or are they uh, Champion's Path rares? Hmm, that's actually a good question. I don't remember it, all of them being hollow, or is it just me being lucky? But I'll take it. That's another card, like I mentioned before, I didn't have. Uh, so now for our last pack, last pack magic with the dreadnought come on give me some of that good luck uh but yeah so uh, that's one of my favorite typings guys it's just ground rock types um for some reason i just i just like them maybe they are all gonna be hollows guys like you're you're kind of like um here's a code card you're kind of promised hollows don't take my word on it. i could be completely wrong but it seems like i'm getting a hollow on every single one so that's what I'm basing it out of. So we got a Leaf Energy. Um, shout out to Unlisted Leaf right there. I've been watching him for years. Lightheart, Pierce. Although I haven't seen many of his uh, recent videos in the past year or so. But I used to watch him maybe like three years ago. Um, and here and there, I'll, I'll still catch a video of his. Uh, so we're gonna, we have a Full Heal as a Reverse, which is a common. I've been getting nothing but comments, right? Yeah, all of our Reverse have been comments. Um, now for our final card of the video and our pack is gonna be yes We ended up getting an ultra rare guys. Hopefully is that Charizard, right? Hopefully is that Charizard we ended up getting oh, we ended up getting a hop trainer a full art So that's actually pretty cool. I'm not familiar with this card. I've never seen it before So I don't know if it's uh, how much it's worth, but if it's oh, it's actually the last card of the video of the video the yeah it is the last card of the video but it's actually the last card of the set so that's interesting but i'll be posting up a price on camera guys if it's worth more than three dollars which i imagine this probably runs around six dollars uh, as i'm seeing it right now so just draw three cards it's kind of like your average uh, card that you kind of get in most of the different sets right but uh that's actually pretty cool guys so centering wise it actually looks decent although it looks bottom 
to the top. If we look at the back right here, hmm, it's actually okay. Like it's not a a 10 right it seems left to right as well a little bit so i feel like the centering will kind of take away from the actual uh grading of it but it's still pretty cool though let me sleeve it up really quick not bad at least we ended up getting an ultra rare and uh, we ended up getting those three hollows so i'm actually pretty happy with it although i, w I wish i would have gotten that charizard uh, but it is what it is guys i'll take it so we ended up getting uh, hopefully you guys are able to see the the actual hollows and and the the actual light is not glaring uh, but yeah we ended up getting the senate scorch hollow the macham hollow and the side guard hollow so my favorite art of the video it's gonna be this one. oh yeah and also the double obviously um v so the actual my favorite art of the video is gonna be this purloin reverse hollow guys just for the actual i think the background is what's doing it for me so if you guys look at it um it, it seems like it's more in the city like like an old school city it kind of reminds me of maybe it reminds me like of france italy and that aspect as the background uh so it's actually really really cool the perspective of the city as you guys notice it's kind of like going downwards it doesn't really and it's also at an angle and then just uh purloin in general she's like kind of just happy and just smirking there and uh, yeah it's actually pretty cool guys that's kind of what i if i were to be walking and i would come up on a purloin i feel like this is how the purloin would like act in a way as saying like hi so this is actually a pretty cool card but i think what does it for me is just the background like i really like the background the details and everything it seems like it's more in the evening since the sky has those blue and purple uh tones to it and then also the the actual window is showing that yellow which means that it's like light right and obviously you wouldn't have that during the daytime so it also shows that like purple dark blue and and other like cool tones in the actual um like road like brick road on the cobblestone i guess you would call it and also on the building so overall guys this is actually a pretty cool art so let me know in the comment section which one you guys chose out of all the cards that i pulled and let me know why and uh, yeah guys i guess that's gonna be the uh, end of this video and i guess i'll just catch you guys on the next one team rocket dross out